Ooh, we have burgers from my burger lab today. Let's start eating. What's up everyone? Welcome to a new eating show on Itoko. I really want to do more eating shows like this. So please help me out by clicking on the subscribe button or like Itoko's Facebook page. Also, tell me what is your favorite food in the comment section below because I might eat it on camera. Today we have burgers and they call this the double trouble at Burger Lab. And I decided to order two. So it's quadruple the double, quadruple the trouble. And it's basically double patty, double cheese, double everything. I mean, the buns are just buns, but yeah, everything else is double. And what's really cool about my burger lab burgers is that they use charcoal bun. That's why the bun is black in color. And I'm gonna show you guys, give you guys the first bite because it is going to be delicious. Look at the patty. Look at the cheese. Look at everything. I'm gonna start eating. Really hungry. This is my first meal of the day. So. Mm. I think this is actually cheese. I think this is cheese, right? Yeah. Mm. Mm, that's new because usually when I have burgers, the cheese are often melted and this is actually like a piece of biscuit. So it's actually new and it's actually nice. I have my Pepsi with me. And I got started so quickly, I forgot to introduce, introduce what else is on my tray. So they have the fries for me. And they also have mashed potato. And I'm gonna show the mashed potato to you guys because it actually comes with, I think, if I'm not mistaken, beef chunks. I think, or beef sauce. I don't know. It's gonna be awesome. I'm gonna continue eating my burger. Mm. Mm. So good. The patty is so, so good. Oh my god. And they actually have cherry tomatoes in the burger. I don't know whether you can see it, but it gives you that sudden burst of sweetness as you're biting through the burger, which is genius.
so, so good. Moving on to the second burger. It's the same, but I feel like I can have more because mm. Mm. the cheese. I love the cheese. I'm gonna open up the sauce. <laughs> This is, I think, Thousand Island. And I'm gonna eat my second burger, animal style. I hope it's gonna be better. Do you think it's going to be better? No? Let's see. Mm. It's good. You want to try? No? The bun is getting mushy because of the sauce that is like mm. <clears throat> It's because of the sauce that is slowly seeping into them <clears throat> But that just makes Everything magical. Just have to be careful here not to bite on the <clears throat> the wrapper.
<clears throat> so many of you are commenting I mean not so many but some of you are commenting on my video saying that I should eat with my mouth closed now trust me I'm trying really really hard I don't eat like this every single day but the reason why I think I'm chewing with my mouth open is simply because the bite that I'm taking on this show is just larger than normal that's why sometimes it's really hard for me to chew with my mouth closed but <clears throat> if you spot that what you can do I think it'll be a fun thing to do is that you can timestamp all the moments in the comment section of me eating with my mouth open or chewing with my mouth open there will be excuse me there will be super fun to look at let's play this game right if you see me chewing earlier when i'm eating my burger with my mouth open just put down the time steps and then i'll try to like correct it and then maybe one day i'll have the perfect video where i'm chewing from start to the end with my mouth closed i just want to address that because i keep getting these comments and i felt like hmm, maybe it's actually a problem right so i want to improve as well so if you guys can point out all the moments where i'm chewing with my mouth open like right now in the comment section that would be super duper helpful mm -hmm. yeah, the fries actually became soggy and the best way <clears throat> to eat soggy fries be to pour uh, some awesome sauce on them. Some fries. So last week I told you guys that I went to the US, right? The worst, <clears throat> no, it's not the worst. It's probably the best experience that I've ever had when it comes to traveling because I had my layover in Tokyo and Hong Kong as well. But the worst <clears throat> part of the trip is that the in-flight entertainment system wasn't working on my 16-hour flight from LAX to Hong Kong. I was actually planning to watch 
a ton of movies before going to sleep because I went to I went to the US for a conference right and the entire week has been super busy super hectic and super tiring together with the flight and all that so I was thinking it's actually <clears throat> I did well the entire week, so I deserve some entertainment on my way back, right? So I was planning to watch like movies and stuff. But one or two hours into the flight, the flight attendant announced that, sorry guys, the, the, the in-flight entertainment system wasn't working. We'll try to restart it. We'll try to reboot it. Nothing happened. So. They restarted it, they tried rebooting it, but still everyone on the flight wasn't able to use the in-flight entertainment system the entire flight. And <clears throat> the good thing is I managed to sleep all the way, but that was probably that flight was probably my worst flight ever. Like even AirAsia did better. I had, I had, AirAsia flights probably did better. Like all of my AirAsia flights would have beaten that flight easily, like hands down. I don't know, but like, I don't travel long distances a lot. But that was an eye opener for me. What is the worst flight experience that you've ever had? Maybe yours could be worse than mine. I don't know. But I would love to hear your story as well if you have like a bad flight experience. Come on, go on. Leave your comment there while I'm finishing my fries. Hmm? I'm gonna start eating my mashed potato. It looks so good, as always. First bite goes to you. No, oh. this is so good. Mm. It's beef sauce. There's no beef on top of it, I think. I don't see any beef. So it's actually beef sauce. Mm. So good. It's just getting worse. <clears throat> I have to end this. That's all guys. I finished eating and I hope you guys liked it. If you like this intro, please give me a thumbs up or click on the like button if you're watching this on Facebook. Also, don't forget to tell me what is your favorite food because I really want to eat it on camera. Don't forget to subscribe as well. Bye!